Ladd Memorial Stadium in Mobile, Alabama, scene of the annual Senior Bowl All-Star football game. And 54 of the nation's finest college seniors are on the field for the 18th renewal of this nationally televised attraction. Such All-Americans as Ray Perkins and Cecil Dowdy from Alabama's undefeated Crimson Tide, Tennessee's Paul Newmoff, Florida's Bill Carr, and George Patton from Georgia are listed on the South roster, while the North lineup is headed by Charles Bubba Smith, Michigan State's great lineman, Ray McDonald, 250-pound fullback from Idaho, tackle Bob Hyland from Boston College, and defensive ace John Charles from Purdue. All first-round selections in the recent professional draft. No less than 28 of the players on the two squads were picked in the first five rounds by the pros. Here is Norm Van Brocklin, former head coach of the Minnesota Vikings, who is coaching the Northern squad. And Otto Graham of the Washington Redskins, coach of the South. Both Van Brocklin and Graham were great quarterbacks in their playing days and are making their debut as senior bowl coaches. Another capacity crowd of more than 40,000 on hand. Temperature in the 70s on a January afternoon in Mobile, Alabama. No championship at stake in the Senior Bowl, but as you can see, some of the fans are still debating about which team was number one in the 1966 college race. The pregame and halftime festivities are always a colorful and entertaining sight at the Senior Bowl, and the fans come early to enjoy the show. Plenty of high-stepping bands. Plenty of pretty girls. Queen of the Senior Bowl, Miss Diane Wilkins of Wauwatosa, Wisconsin, America's Junior Miss of 1966. Escorted by Mr. T.K. Jackson, Jr., Vice President of the Mobile Arts and Sports Association. Miss Wilkins welcomes the fans in the stands and the millions of television viewers as the players come onto the field for their pregame introductions. Senior Bowl number 18 coming up. The South has won 11, the North 5, and one game ended in a tie. The North captains in white uniforms are Jim Flanagan, number 52, linebacker from the University of Pittsburgh. Number 15, Virgil Carter, quarterback from Brigham Young University. The South leaders are Ken Avery, 51, linebacker from the University of Southern Mississippi, and quarterback Terry Southall from Baylor University. The North wins the toss and elects to receive. The South will take advantage of a 10 to 15 mile win out of the Southwest and kick off. Gene Upshaw of Texas A&I is kicking. And it's taken by Harry Wilson of Nebraska at the 10. A 21 yard return before being tackled by Bullwood of North Carolina. Carter at quarterback, Wilson, Big Ray McDonald of Idaho at the running back spots. Kenny Last of Minnesota at flanker. That's Wilson for two yards. The handoff to McDonald this time. He crashes up the middle for nine yards, and it's a first down. Harry Wilson, he's going wide. Finally chased out of bounds after a 25-yard gain. Now Carter dropping back for his first pass of the ball game. Complete to last. 13-yard gain and another first down. Harry Wilson. A five-yard gain. Tackle by Wood. McDonald. Finally stopped at the three-yard line. A great run. And let's look at that one again. 
McDonald is 6'5". He weighs just 250 pounds. He breaks one tackle, two, three. And he's finally stopped just short of the goal. Wilson. He stopped for no gain on this one. Second and goal at the three. McDonald. Touchdown. A 69-yard drive in just eight plays. Carter holding. Larry Wahos of Nebraska is kicking. It's up. It's good. And the North goes in front in the opening minutes of the game. After an exchange of punts, the South takes over at its 43, midway in the opening period. South only quarterback, but Big Bubba Smith, the Michigan State star, stops this one for a six-yard loss. The first of many big plays for the 278-pound All-American. A screen pass to Jim Bowl of New Mexico State, but no gain on the play. Southall fading the pass again. A fine catch by Ed Carrington of Virginia. But it's short of a first down, and Southall is back to putt. A fake kick. Terry Southall picks up the first down. And let's look at that play again. On an earlier punt, Southall detected the North trying to set up a kick return. Look at the North line peeling off to its right. Heads up football by the Baylor quarterback. A handoff to Billy Masters of LSU, and it's good for two yards. A pass complete to Ray Perkins of Alabama for four yards. Terry Southall still in at quarterback. This is a third down pass, and it's incomplete. Now Dick Absher of Maryland is attempting a field goal from the 38. It's partially blocked. A big scramble for the ball. And Alabama's Wayne Trimble recovers. A big break for the South. And watch this next play. Southall gets good protection. Perkins is wide open. Touchdown! Let's look at this 32-yard scoring pass again. The Alabama All-American has his man beaten. A perfect pass. Trimble holding, Absher kicking. And we have a new ball game. Early in the second quarter, the North takes over at its 33. Carter still at quarterback. A handoff to Wilson. And a seven-yard gain by the Nebraska speedster. It's to McDonald this time. A big hole. And a 12-yard gain into South Territory. Bob Graham of Oregon State with the ball. He's finally wrestled out of bounds after a gain of 14 yards. McDonald. And the south line stops the big fullback on this one. Carter. And his pass is deflected at the line by Gene Trosh of Miami. A fake to Grimm. A pitch out to McDonald. And the south stops the drive. Wahols is back to punt. But neither team can get a sustained drive underway until late in the second quarter, when the North takes over deep in its territory with the score still tied at 7-7. Seven to seven. That's Carter dropping back to pass from his own five-yard line. A fine catch by Grimm, and a gain of 33 yards. Another pass. This one complete to Chet Anderson of Minnesota. Good for 12 yards and another first down at the South 43. That's Grimm shifting wide at the bottom of the screen. Carter fading back again. And Grimm is wide open. A 43-yard touchdown pass. Wahol's kicking. 
It's good, and the North goes out in front 14 to 7 with just a minute and 14 seconds remaining in the half. The mass bands form the outline of the state of Alabama in a colorful halftime presentation. Miss Wilkins is the ninth America's Junior Miss to reign as queen of the Senior Bowl. She won her title and a $10,000 scholarship in the annual Mobile Pageant and is now attending Marymount College in Tarrytown, New York. Established tradition of the Senior Bowl, it's another spectacular halftime show. The North leading 14 to 7. Walholz kicking off for the North. Cunningham takes it deep for the South at the nine yard line. Cunningham with a fine return to the South 45. Southall is still at quarterback. And the handoff goes to Cunningham. Bill Powell of Missouri and Carl Stith of Nebraska stop him for no gain. Southall now looking for a receiver, but Stith, the big Nebraska tackle, smears him for a nine-yard loss. Third down, long yardage. The pass, intended for Perkins. But the North is double-teaming the Alabama All-American, and it's broken up. Southall back to punt. Gets it away. Taken by Charles of Purdue. Fine coverage downfield by the South line. Corey Kolar of North Dakota now at quarterback for the North. The handoff to Wilson. And again a four yards. Kolar dropping back to try his first pass. Complete to Effie Barney of Iowa State for 10 yards. McDonald this time. And he gets five. It's Grimm. And he's stopped by Ken Avery. Kolar fading back. It's complete to Minnesota's Anderson, and it's another first down. A quick one to the split end, and last is stopped after a four-yard gain. It's fumble, but Kolar recovers. Wilson is stopped short of the first down. Walls is back to punt. And Avery blocks it. A big break for the South. And Norm Van Brockton is checking with his press box scout to see what went wrong on that play. Southall is taking to the air on first down. A long one. But the double coverage on Perkins pays off as Walls makes a fine interception. Kolar is still in at quarterback. The handoff to McDonald, and it's good for three yards. Wilson this time. He picks up six. It's third and one. But Kolar crosses up the defense on this call, complete to Anderson. An overall gain of 19 yards, and the North is out of danger. A handoff to Grimm. You can see why the Oregon State speedster was voted the North's outstanding back. A 35-yard gain. Wilson again. Fine blocking with the big North line, and another first down. Kolar gets perfect protection on this pass. A great catch by Barney. Walholz kicking. And it's good. 
a happy halfback and his coach, and a more relaxed North bench. Walholtz teeing up the ball to kick. Cunningham takes it at the two-yard line. The Ole Miss speedster is finally caught from behind on a great effort by Minnesota's Kenny Lass. A 51-yard kickoff return, longest in senior bowl history. Southall still at quarterback. And it's complete to Dick Redding of Northwestern Louisiana State for 16 yards. A draw play, and LSU's Billy Masters picks up nine yards on the final play of the third period. The North leading 21 to 7 as we start the final quarter. Second and one at the North 22. Perkins is wide open for eight yards and a first down at the 14. Cunningham trying to go wide. And he's cut down after a gain of three. And Perkins is well covered on this one. Third and seven at the 11. A quick one to Masters, but it picks up only one yard. So it's fourth down. Southall dropping back. He has plenty of time. Reading is open. Touchdown for the Northwestern Louisiana Speedster, and the South is back in this ball game. But Absher's kick is wide. It's no good. North 21, South 13. Upshaw kicking off. It's taken by Graham at the 14. And tackle by North Carolina's Bo Wood stops him at the 25. Kolauer is the quarterback. He goes to the air on first down. It's intercepted. But interference is called and the North retains possession. The handoff to McDonald. And Avery leads the tacklers as he stopped after a five-yard gain. Wilson this time. And again a 14 yards for the Nebraska star. It's Grimm. He grinds out seven tough yards. McDonald trying to turn the corner and Tennessee's Paul Newmoff leads the pursuit. Third and one. Grimm catches the South defenders stacked in tight. Heads downfield and picks up 22 yards. Wilson is now in at halfback in place of Grimm. The Nebraska speedster has the ball. He's on the way and he takes it in. A 15-yard touchdown run. And the North has its two-touchdown lead again. Wahl's kicking off. It's taken by Jim Bowl. A 26-yard return. Southall's the quarterback. He's chased out of the pocket. Now throws complete to Tennessee's Johnny Mills. An 18-yard gain to the North 47. Tennessee State's Bill Tucker at fullback now. He picks up nine yards on a draw play. Great faking by Southall. Throwing now, complete to Tucker for 11 yards to the 27. A quick one to Mills again as Southall is racing the clock. Look out. There's Big Bubba. And it's picked off by Jim Planning into Pittsburgh. And another South drive is stopped by an interception. That's McDonald. He gets 10 yards. It's Wilson this time. He adds nine more. 
The clouds are rolling in off Mobile Bay. The handoff to Wilson. A gain of five yards. McDonald, he can really move for a 250-pounder. A 16-yard gain. It's McDonald again. And he gets five more. Carter's in at quarterback now. And Nebraska's Pete Tatman has replaced McDonald. Tatman is wide open. Touchdown! And here is Charles Bubba Smith, voted the outstanding player of the game. And let's look at a few plays to see why. Number 84, left tackle in the white jersey. Michigan State All-American is everywhere. 